Come on. My junk. Woo. Hell yeah, dude. How much weight is this? Fucking A, man. First step on log, when you get, you gotta have to get hand placement right. Usually right in the middle is fine for me. But then once you get it up, you kind of squat down into it. But when you have you pull it into you, like, you see how my elbows are flared out? Yeah. So like when you get it right here, if you notice, I don't like have to jerk with my back to get it like this. Because what I've been noticing with you guys is that like when you get it right here, you guys kind of struggle. You guys have to pull it back like that. Mm -hmm. But when you grab it like that, you literally just roll it over your stomach, which makes it a lot easier. Do it so one like, more time? Huh? Do it one more time? So like, I'll just do it like a regular, I'm not gonna go over any steps right here, I'm just gonna do it how I would do it. See how easy it is, like the jerk? Yeah. It's just, you have to flare, flare your elbows out, hold it against your chest. And it, it just come up with it. It almost looks like you're using like your hips to kind of yeah, assist you, with you, it. Yeah, you push your hips like you just hold it like this, and you have your you kind of lock your lats back. Yeah. And hold it into that same. Try and hold it like basically try and hold it on your chest, and then when you come back, it just rolls up. Oh, I see what you're saying. Here at Market Barber, we teach people. We teach fundamentals. We teach the fundamentals. All right. If you look at my first few logs, I would just lean all the way back to try and get it up. Right. Okay. So like, it's a lot of, it makes a big difference when you do that. So, oh, I think like this. And so keep it tight to him, is what you're saying? Hold it on your chest, like push it down into your chest. Like this? Yeah. Kind of almost bent over? Yeah, literally, hold mm -hmm. it into your chest now. And I'm using my, and I'm using like a, like a pelvic thrust to kind of compensate. Yeah, and now come back and like. Eh, I mean, put it back down. Wait, no, put it completely down. Make sure you have your hands like straight in the middle. Almost here. It's perfectly fine. Because I noticed you're like almost all the way back here, which is going to make it yeah. a lot harder because of the imbalance. And this makes a huge difference in yeah. the entire thrust itself. So up. Now squat down. Hold your chest against it. Now come up. And then. Yeah, it's getting better. Also, your feet are very outward. I mean, I, I prefer more inward. Mm -hmm. No, like just for me, I feel like if I have a wider base, I've got, I've got less room to, uh, I don't know, balance. I feel like, so like, like a wider base. I notice that you're base. like this when you grab it almost. Mm -hmm. I prefer it to just be straight because it just screws my hands up because my wrist. For sure. So like, I'll just show you how I basically do it. Grab straight in the middle, and if you notice, I'm like actually kind of leaning forward into it like that. Yeah. So you're not you're not even tilting. I'm not forward. I'm not like standing like this. I'm like this, holding it against my chest. So it's almost like a, like you're, you're you're looking like a rug. Yeah. Okay. And basically, yeah. So you just have to hold it on your chest. So. Up. Yeah. You notice how easy that rolled up. Mm -hmm. So we're like, cause what I notice when you guys roll, like sometimes it's like this and you're trying to push it back, which I don't really have to do that. It's automatically in position just to press it up. It took me a few times to get it down. It's not really the easiest thing to do. Also, don't do the wash. Yeah, he's always double dick. It looks dangerous. He's like, no, he's like this. Oh, when he does, oh, okay, like, yeah, yeah. He'll throw it up, like he but he'll, he'll, he'll drop his legs. He'll, he'll drop he his legs. And he catches it. It's the same thing with the shirt. It's the same thing. Yeah. I prefer, he's like, I prefer to, he's like, he's like catching me. Like, yeah. on it, I have strong shoulders, so like, what works best for me is just going like this. Yeah. If you notice when I get into my heavier sets. So I'll, I'll bring up the weight. It felt easier, yeah. The roll, it's like just straight up. 
Because I noticed that time you had more of your chest pinned against it. You want your chest like pinned. Yeah. And you want to just be holding it. Like you literally, so there's not, you're not even moving your hands. Like literally when you get it right here, you just hold it like it's that. It's just momentum in your body. Just momentum. You just like literally like explosiveness up and it just rolls on its own. You don't have to like pull in with your biceps or anything. It's right in position. Yeah. Yeah. I want to get I want to get like a 270 press by the end of next year because I just started doing log like a few months back, but I got really good. I, I was just working on form, and when you work on your form, it makes a huge difference. So like when I first did log, I could only do 155 for one within the first week of training it, and then two weeks later, with training on form, just the jerk alone, I did 155 for four, like 155 for three, and then I went up from 160 to 170. And now I'm at like 190, so you know it makes a big difference just to getting the movement down. Yeah. Strong man Saturday session. We got Ryan coming out of here with the long press. Let's see it. And he pressed it. You're working my angles. You're working my angles too bad. I let Josh do the camera stuff. Okay, well this is just selfie mode, but who cares? It's another glorious day at Margate Barbell. Strong man Saturday. We will see ya. Woo! All right now. All right, up here again. Down, what are you on the speaker? Oh. Yeah, I'm Yeah, that felt a little weird. I think it's because you might have had your hands a little. I have one thing that always happens to me. I mean, if you, if you jump like this, when you press it, sometimes on like my right side, it'll push the like the bar thing that's right there. Yeah. Push it down into a deeper side of my hand, which will make it a little unbalanced. Notice like right when I get here, I go like straight up and then press it. Yeah. Yeah, it's because you know you gotta work on speed and strong man. And doesn't holding the weight also just tire you out, just keeping the weight up there. Yeah, keeping the weight up here, like actually like it hurts it like basically suffocates you if you hold it too long. Yeah. It's kinda like restricting all uh, restricting. Yeah. Like, like you can breathe but it'll be like flow. it'll like kinda cut half of it off. No, yeah, because you're like you're you doing have like a like chest. an incline uh, uh, bench where you're like bouncing it off your chest. Yeah, and it's also a big thing that's like just right this on your neck. And that's you just true. Yeah. Straight up in the ceiling. Mm How -hmm. do you want to go? Someone will point it out. <laughs> and they they pointed out Walsh's uh, Walsh's left. Uh, you know, <laughs> I'm great for attention. Let's go. Good shit. <laughs> nice. Alright, if we're gonna do that, then let's Good just luck. move it up and then go this way. Right. I've only done this, I've made One, it two, two racks. Ah, oh, yeah, see, How much does that tire weigh? Five, five, A five lot. thousand pounds! Uh, 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 oh, uh, fuck! Uh, uh.
I didn't know if you bastard. Sorry. <laughs> you fucking got me everywhere. Sorry. All right, let's do one more. Dick. Sorry. Not a dick. Splattered on you. I'm no. wearing one of my favorite freaking workout shirts today. You okay, we're going to try this <laughs> again. We're going to flip it into the dry. That's all we need to do right now. And I'm, I'm getting the Rainbow Converse wet. Actually, you know what? Fuck it. It's all in good. It's all hey, in good spirit. It's a, dirt, you know, it's a dirty sport. You know, you know, I have to actually flip it, right? <laughs> like, like, and not all the way. Just flip it once and then roll it. That's what I was trying to fucking do. <laughs> and then you let go. Whatever. Fuck See, it. See, because we're not the brightest, but we're the strongest. <laughs> we're putting that on a we're fucking T-shirt. Uh, <laughs> we're the stupidest. <laughs> I will just strong man, not smart man. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I will just say right, my right, right, right. He Both said two flips. He didn't say one flip I need in two a row. You guys got yourself into this mess. Yeah, you I'm get going. yourself out of Come it. Come on, boys. There you go. There we go. There we go. I can't fucking rip it. Almost. There we go. Almost. There you go. Stop, 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 stop. God damn it. I'm fucking stuck in this giant ass puddle. Damn. See, this is why we got John Gordon as a teacher. There you go. Walsh does not teach us this in his Walsh English just wants us to lift it. <laughs> he said if you can't lift it, you're not it. for it. <laughs> you tell me, where do you want it? Where do you want it? Well, I'm just trying to do it here, and then we're going to keep going progressively back with smaller tires. Shit. Like horse? Well, let's realize like, it. Well, then, decide where you want them now. Let's do this. Let's do this. If you can't flip the tire once, what do you want to do with it? It's strongman cornhole. Oh, this is we're doing strongman cornhole. Yeah. Well, you know what? Let's let's do this, okay? Can you can you get me back. some sort of block or something so that you don't have to pick it from you the know, ground every time? We had Walsh take this out for us because none of us were able to do it oh. the last time. <laughs> like try, when you we're get dirty when you get tired. Like, okay, so these particular tires they are shit to flip because like you gotta like it's hard to get under them. So like if something you wanna do like for training, like the fucking tires in my backyard, I've just got a small little block of wood and it's up like half an inch so I can get under. Okay. Jump. Yes. Why? You don't have tires at your house that you can flip? That'll work. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. All right, we're going to do it right Close. here. Right here? This is a stupid idea. Closer, closer, closer. Long ways. Lengthwise, there you go. There you go. This, put a little bit more push, a little bit more torque. Are you sure it's not going to break the block? There you go. I hope it doesn't break. Yeah. And... <laughs>